Ask not what your country can do for you, ask what you can do for your country. Let us never negotiate out of fear, but let us never fear to negotiate. Mankind must put an end to war, before war puts an end to mankind. The great enemy of truth is very often not the lie deliberate, contrived and dishonest, but the myth persistent, persuasive, and unrealistic. Too often we hold fast to the cliches of our forebears. We subject all facts to a prefabricated set of interpretations. We enjoy the comfort of opinion, without the discomfort of thought. A man may die, nations may rise and fall, but an idea lives on. The greater our knowledge, increases the more our ignorance unfolds. The time to repair the roof, is when the sun is shining. The one unchangeable certainty, is that nothing is unchangeable, or certain. Those who dare to fail miserably, can achieve greatly. Efforts and courage are not enough without purpose, and direction. The unity of freedom, has never relied on uniformity of opinion. A child miseducated, is a child lost. Our problems are man-made, therefore, they may be solved by man. No problem of human destiny, is beyond human beings. Peace is a daily, a weekly, a monthly process, gradually changing opinions, slowly eroding old barriers, quietly building new structures. Forgive your enemies, but never forget their names. Change is the law of life. And those who look only to the past or present, are certain to miss the future. Those who make peaceful revolution impossible, will make violent revolution inevitable. The supreme reality of our time, is the vulnerability of this planet. Conformity is the jailer of freedom, and the enemy of growth. As we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest appreciation, is not to utter words, but to live by them. It is an unfortunate fact, that we can secure peace only by preparing for war. There are risks and costs to action, but they are far less than the long-range risks of comfortable inaction. A nation reveals itself not only by the men it produces, but also by the men it honors, the men it remembers. Things do not happen. Things are made to happen. There is always inequality in life. Some men are killed in a war, and some men are wounded, and some men never leave the country. Life is unfair. In giving rights to others which belong to them, 
we give rights to ourselves and to our country. Our progress as a nation can be no swifter than our progress in education. The human mind is our fundamental resource. We must use time as a tool, not as a couch. World peace, like community peace, does not require that each man love his neighbor, it requires only that they live together with mutual tolerance, submitting their disputes to a just and peaceful settlement. The courage of life is often a less dramatic spectacle than the courage of a final moment, but it is no less a magnificent mixture of triumph and tragedy. The goal of education is the advancement of knowledge and the dissemination of truth. When power leads man toward arrogance, poetry reminds him of his limitations. When power narrows the area of man's concern, poetry reminds him of the richness and diversity of existence. When power corrupts, poetry cleanses. Victory has a thousand fathers, but defeat is an orphan. The ignorance of one voter in a democracy impairs the security of all. If a free society cannot help the many who are poor, it cannot save the few who are rich.